Yeah. This morning, Washington State is cleaning up from a damaging tornado. It touched down Thursday in the city of Battleground, and crews worked through the night to clear the debris. The twister is the latest example of severe weather to hit the Pacific Northwest this week. David Begno is in Battleground, where dozens of homes are now damaged. David, good morning. Good morning. It was an EF1 tornado that touched down at least twice over a two mile residential area. No one was hurt, but there was damage here at the county store where we are. This is a pretty large branch and it went flying through a window like a spear shattering glass while people were inside the building. Tornadoes in Washington state are rare, very rare. In fact, yesterday's was only the second one this year. It's ripping whole trees up, dude. Thursday's tornado packed winds topping 104 miles per hour. It uprooted dozens of trees and snapped some nearly right in half. It does appear a tornado did go through multiple trees now, multiple lines. About 36 homes and a pair of businesses were damaged. Vanessa easily works at a mini mart. The wind came through the store, pushed those front doors out, in, and back out, and then the water started pouring through the roof. Wooden stakes sliced through one home like daggers. Andrew Yozamp says it took about 30 seconds for the storm to pass. It looked like the Wizard of Oz out here. There was debris flying everywhere, trees flying down the road. High winds, heavy rain, and hail have been pounding the Pacific Northwest for almost a week now. Some areas have been soaked with as much as 18 inches of water. Construction crews have been working around the clock to clear mud and dirt from landslides that have closed roads across Washington and Oregon. A normally 40-minute commute outside Portland took more than three hours Thursday. Some 550 miles south in California Sierra Nevada mountains, it is snow that's snarling traffic. As much as three feet or forecasts putting plow drivers in overtime. It went from uh, blue skies to dark. It was like being inside of a clothes dryer with gravel inside. In the Sierra Nevada, they could get another two feet of snow across Oregon and Washington. More rain is expected through Monday. Gail, if it's dry where you are, be glad. <laughs> and see, this, is. see this smile on my face? Yes, I'm very glad. Thank you, David. But feeling for the people there, certainly.